Hello, it's Throwback Thursday. I'm Laura Ribbons. This is Fit and 15. Woo! It's gonna be an awesome day. Let's move a little bit. Two arms in front. No weights today. Let's use our body a little bit. Can you bring those feet together? Throw it away with those arms. Yeah. Today is the first day of a three-day conference that I'm doing online, virtually. It's all on social media. More importantly, it's a huge community of amazing people. I must say I'm excited. Marching three. One, two, and three. Yeah. How's your week been? A little bit crazy, depending on where you live. In the Cayman Islands, we had to pivot a little bit because of the weather. Go back. And I do not know how Cancun is doing, but I pray, okay. Weather can be unpredictable. But you must always respect that with those waves. Yes. Step down. Right here. Now, can you move up a little bit? Yes. Move back. Right here. Wipe your feet. Hamstring curl. Yeah. Woo! Move up. Easy step touch. Gonna start the timer. Yeah. Because I have no sense of time. And I can do this for an hour and a half. Hamstring curl. Let's go back to knee lifts, you guys. Bring it right up. Woo! Engage your balance when we add more reps. So double up. Double up. Abs are in. Abs are in. The leg you're standing on. Slightly bent. Yes. You beautiful. Two more. Easy march. Shoulder. Let's get our hands together. Stretch out through the shoulders. Ah. Shoot your hip up. Oh yeah, St. Baldur's. We normally, every year, amazing fundraiser for St. Baldrick's. And I must check what happened because it's usually so temp in September. Four. And I didn't donate any, any money yet, so I'm gonna find out about that. One shoulder, over and back. Come on, loosen it up. Feel that stretch go right down the back of that shoulder into your back. Thank goodness your abs are pulled in. Other arm, over. Sweep it, sweep it. Pulling in through your abs. And you know, ribs to hips. Last set of two. Let's try swinging our arms. Swing them, nice and hot. Yes. One, two, three, all the way. 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 Yes. Come on. Get crazy. Let that body move. Two more. Yes, one more. Okay, it's worth those feet a little bit. I know it's not barefoot Sunday, but in those shoes, or maybe you are barefoot. Let's move those feet. Ready? Feet, hip distance apart. So if your hips are here, so are your feet. If your hips are here, so are your feet. Here we go, because I want you to be stacked. Ankle, knee, hip, on the toes. On the toes, on the toes. What muscle are you contracting? Your lower leg, your calf muscle. Yes. Now lately I've been talking about decluttering, but more importantly, how sometimes it's easier. You open the door, you look at the mess, and you close the door. So, 
passing out a little helpful hit list to a few people. If you want that list, drop a comment below. Good morning on the toes. Good, so here we go with the feet. Roll them out, roll them in. Roll them out, roll them in. And what made me think about decluttering is I started putting on things I found in my closet that I haven't used for years. Easy march. Like these pants. <laughs> these pants are leaving my house soon. Check it out. They are probably about 20 years old. How many of you have clothing items at least 20, 25, 30 years old? I bet you have at least one. All right, squeeze the glutes. Ribs to hips. One leg, little leg. And you know the drill. Side of your foot leading the way. Why? Your hip flexors are so strong. You want to use gluteus medius and minimus to do this work. Who would rather help? That hip flexor of yours would rather turn that leg out and say, hey, I can do it. Sure he can. But what about strengthening these guys? For those of you that spend any time in the day sitting down, not me, but if you do, you need to make sure these guys get stretched, stretched out. Sitting down, they get nice and short. Good, give me a step tap. Right here, let's move. This is Throwback Thursday. Keep it simple and move. Good, move up. Move back. Beautiful. Get centered. Ribs to hips. If you're holding a chair, the wall, here I can make it look like I'm holding the wall. See I'm holding the wall? <laughs> Bend the leg you're standing on a tab. That means the inside of that standing foot is pressing on the ground. It's real easy to roll outwards. Squeeze the glutes. Check yourself, what's your foot doing? Come on, side of that leg. If you don't have a wall, you can balance. If you're one of those people, and I know a few of you out there that love to put in that, doing that super girl or super guy look, hands on hips, that is fine as long as the abs are in and you are not arching your back. Come on. Oh, two more. Nice. And easy mark. All right, let's do a side squat. Sit. Oh, the first couple always a little bit of a uh, stretch out your butt. Stretch it out. Squeeze. Stretch it out. Squeeze. And again. Now you know I talk about this a lot. Level of desire. What is it? You decide. In today's world, this year, 2020, I'm sure you've had at least one day where you said, do I have to get outside and go walking? Do I need to do Laura's video? What am I doing for my activity? Eh, I don't feel like it. Whoa, wouldn't it be awesome if we could change that I don't feel like it? Yeah, I sure as blazes don't feel like a few things every day. But, what's your level of desire? How do you want to show up? I am finding for the last two weeks to have that consistency of being in here at 6.30 in the morning is one of the hardest things. Why? What gets in the way? A lot of life, pets, making smoothie for people going to work. But I'm sure I could change that if I just change my level of desire. So I'm on. I'm on myself to get it done. Come on. You ready? I know you are. Hold it. Here we go. Good morning. Keep it right here. Level of desire, what is it? I have the most amazing day coming up. Doing a three day virtual conference. It'll be such an awesome experience. With rank makers. Sadly, it's too late to sign up. I tried to tell you about it. Social media information. Unbelievable community of people. I did it last year, it changed my life. 
Good morning. Hi, Anna. I can read that. I can't read the others, so I welcome you. Thank you. Come on, sit down a little bit. Hold it. In step down. In step down. You got it. Yes. Come on, hold four. Three. Two. Squeeze your butt to come up. Outer thigh. Outer thigh. Good morning, Wendy. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Tighten. Four more. Three, two. Come on, shake it up. Lymphatic shakedown. I don't care if you feel ridiculous. If you're in a chair, don't care. Balance. Your lymphatic system, its job is to detoxify you. Bad news, it doesn't have its own pump. So the human body is meant to move so that pump can work. Now, do you think it's interesting the way the world has gotten so sedentary, including children, that we have a lot of lymphatic issues going on? March. So for you to shake it down every day, Keep moving and help that lymphatic system work. Detoxifying your body. It's a no-brainer, everybody. Get on the horse, get off the horse. You ready? We're gonna do it for a minute. Here we go. Get on the horse. Sit. Get off the horse. Sit. Get on. Get off. Come on. Over 10 minutes in. Over. Yes. Are you pushing your butt back behind you? Yes. Woo! Again. Come on, pick it up. Halfway there. Large muscle group. Pain free in your knees. Please. What happens if your knees hurt? You stop. Or super slow it down. Yes. All the way over. Come on. Whew. Yeah. Heart rate going up. 10 seconds. You got this. Over. Yeah. Heart rate up. I love it. Here we go. Hacky sack. Come on, if you're gonna play hacky sack, like I had to, I did, not had to, wanted to, in the airport, stuck going, delayed flight, going to Little Cayman. These are the muscles you use in hacky sack. You got it. Knee lift. Come on, bring that thigh right up. Little march. Ready? 16. Legs, one, two, three, four, five, six. Don't forget, they're coming to you. Keep that back straight, opposite hand. Maybe you only touch your shin. That's cool. Breathing, two more. Nice. Easy march. All right. Ready? One foot forward. One back. You are totally standing on this left. Get those. For those of you that always are doing this, forget it. Arms in front. Push your butt back behind you. Got it? Now put it under you. Know the difference. Push it back behind you. Yeah. Bend both knees. It's almost like on your mark, you said go. You're here. Got it? You're down. This leg is stretching out like crazy. Hamstring. Can you stay on that foot? So if your shin is against your tongue of your shoe, do not move your shin. Four more. Three. Two, 
One, hold it. So that knee is going back and forth. You gotta fix it. Down you go. Leg extension. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Come on, tighten up. Four. Three. Two. One. Mark the tank. Go. Keep it. That standing leg should be talking to you a little bit. Weight on the heel. Four. Three. Two. Come on. Easy march. Scale the window five. Can you get a three, four? All right. Other leg. 14 minutes in. We're almost done. Ready? Shin. Knee over the foot. So if I'm tucking, touching the tongue of my shoe, I stay there. On your market set, go. Sticking this butt up. Ready? Own it. Hamstring. Hamstring. Need extra support? Hand on your thigh. Can you do this and be pain free? This guy is stabilizing you along with the inside of your knee. Inside of your shoe. Yeah. 